So I just, we just, you know, I had some real heart to heart with you lately, like just about the fact that it's like, it's just your world. Nobody does this shit better than you. And it's like, when you're gone, you know, obviously Papa Bear's here now. So we are, you know, we, we understand the priorities, but you know, when you're gone, I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm sure I speak for everybody in the live when it's like, yo, we really miss you. Like, we really miss your presence. And just like, we miss the bars. We miss the excitement that you bring. So it's like, you know, I just like, I've been on you lately to just, you know, you know what time it is. And you know, I'm coming over um this weekend too. So yeah, blood so we clot get to lie work. Enough. Yeah, two blood clot lies. No, I'm really this there. Man, this man been saying he was coming to my house for the last two weeks, y'all. So now nah, y'all got to make sure he come over here. While I lied to him, I, no, I swear I did this. He kept on lying. So I was like, yo, no, I'm cooking for you this time. I'm cooking steak, shrimp, and all of that. <laughs> and he's still, he still stood me up. I no, I didn't stand you up. That's not you. Don't make me sound like that. All right, no. But listen, on the real shit, I am, I love you so much, Drake. Like, so just, so just let me tell y'all the real shit. I was going to say it, but I didn't want to say it too much. He single-handedly got me out of my writer's block. And I'm never going to forget it. And I'm going to shout it to the fucking world on the mountaintops because that's the real shit. That's my hand to God. He sent me something and it made me feel so competitive again. I was like, yo, what the fuck am I doing? Like, get, like you need to start writing. And Thanks. whenever I hear Drake and Wayne rap it just it's always going to inspire something in me but outside of drake's raps it's his like pep talks he'll he'll send one text that'll make me really like reevaluate everything he's a fucking genius as a musical artist but also just as a human like please everybody know that like that's real shit like that's, that's not very sweet. um and so i love you very much you guys, you. it's about to, the song is about to come out. I'm going to try to go live tomorrow, y'all. I'm not in, get a lot of time because somebody came extra late. I'm not going to say no names, Tay, but he played his fucking fucking song. As always. But, you guys, go and listen to Steve wow. Green featuring the two goats, Drizzy Drake and Little Motherfucking Wayne. Go I'm going to pull up. Beat me up, Scotty, right now. Go listen to Fractions. And yeah. Drake Drake Fractions is a fucking slap. So it is a slap. Is slap. And and tomorrow tomorrow I'm pulling out my um my YMCMB sweatshirt, the old one with the Birdman logo on it, like just for you know what I'm saying, just because. But listen, yo, listen, I have some listen, YMCMB slippers. Listen, I'm in the middle of the street, but I just want to tell you this: I love you with all my heart, and I'm I'm glad that you, I'm glad that you I'm glad that you got in your bag for this re-release. But you know what time it is now. I'm not taking you know I don't I'm not gonna say too much on here, but. It's that time, so um, okay. I'll be there this weekend. I love you. I love you too, Drake. Okay, bye. bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. All right, you guys, bye. I love you so much for tuning in. God bless you. It was a lot more stuff that I wanted to say, but we ran out of time. But you guys, check out the music and let me know how you feel about the music. Um, I'm wishing you guys all the best. Um, was there anything else I needed to say? Uh... Not that I can think of. Go check out the music, you guys, and let me know what you think. I love you dearly, okay? Bye.